YMCA of the Capital Area is reopening one of their locations for the first time since the 2016 flood with a few new features. Our Zach Labe is live with details on what folks can expect. And to see if you moved inside, Zach. So, what is what can you show us this morning? Hey, good morning, Courtney. I'm here at the CB Pennington YMCA, and we are inside the Wellness Center. And I'm also joined by CEO Christian. Can you tell us? So, I know you guys had shut down a bit for the flood, and this is one of the newest areas. What uh, new amenities do you guys have here? Yeah, so, I mean, pretty much everything you see, right? So, all of this stuff used to be in our gymnasium. So, we've kind of come in, we had to fix all of the walls, we had to repaint. Uh, and we're still not even done yet. There's still some things we want to do along the windows and do some different things like that. But, you know, the selectorized equipment, we brought in a lot of new cardio equipment so really just trying to um, reestablish the wellness facility here awesome and so you guys also have this uh, <clears throat> reopening ceremony happening this mm -hmm. weekend what's going to happen then yeah so again I think just a celebration with the community we're trying to get people out here um, I think again it's one of those things we try to remind people that we are a 501 c3 community service nonprofit organization we're not a fitness center health and wellness is one of those things we do so really it's about engaging the community and this weekend is is that opportunity to kind of re-engage with the community on the activities here at the YMCA. Awesome. And so what has been the response from the members finding out that this is reopening? Uh, very positive. People are excited. They're excited to kind of get back into their space. Um, they're excited about the continued improvements that are going on here. Uh, and we're excited to kind of just reestablish ourselves in the community. So it's been really, really positive. All right. Awesome. Well, if you want any more information about the YMCA and how you can become a member, you can find that on our website and on our free BR Proud app. Reporting live at the YMCA, Zach Labe, NBC Local 33 News.